My name is uh, Roberta Luongo. <laughs> Too late to thaw out turkey for a Christmas dinner. Here's how you do it. You get an electric drill and a big bit and you make holes all over the frozen bird. You fill them full of firecrackers. You light the fuses and you run like hell. You'll have a whole lot of manageable colors with a nice smoky flavor. This is the night of nights when collectively we bow to the excellence of those who said, I will build me a restaurant better than all others, filled with the fruits of my labor, resplendent with the manifestations of my imagination, enriched by my dreams, by my dash, my daring, overcoming the pain and persistence of pernickety partners and guaranteed success forever by the exchange of my balls for a banker's backing. That was a funny line. My restaurant will stand tall. My restaurant will stand tall on the high street, mighty on a mountain, tucked with tenderness and care into a tawdry alley, where in its quirky glory, I believe, I may start a new trend in dining and damned be those who may say, nay, it will never work. This is the night for those who came before and left their mighty marks of good food and exemplary service resplendent on their land for the pioneers of the business who took big chances in their youth and who, despite the slings and arrows of fickle customers, fiendish cooks and a constantly flummoxed and ever-changing staff went on to reap the rewards of dogged and perpetual persistence. This is where we lift our voices in awe to those on the outside who gathered up the goods and services that we needed and delivered them to our doors. The fresh and the fabulous, the fish and the fowl, the french fries and the fa-la-las, the napkins and the knick-knacks, the nuts, the bolts, and all else that made us not the same but standouts from the common herd. Those who said, 90 days, why not? Why not indeed? This night is for those who burned their pinkies on the hot stoves, who splendidly seared the salmon, fritzed the froth, made lemonade of lemons and added always a dash of their very souls to make it better. Leaving naught but plates awash with goodness and a minimum of fingerprints to be delivered to expectant tables far, far beyond the heat lamps. This is for those who said, bring on the party of 15 on this busy Saturday night and hold still but for a moment while, while we arrange the chairs. For those who said a corked wine, let me get you another. This is a night for all of you, the chosen fabulous few who paused not even for a moment to weep on their pillows, but rose always from the depths of despair and went on, despite adversity, to be the industry's bona fide winnies. winners. This is a night for the champions. <laughs>